I encourage you, come to Payton Medical. Learn. Take a class. Because you, when you leave here, you're going to be an artist. Well, I'm not sure if Ryan is the official spokesman for this group, but he would do a great job. The class, he is, the class he's encouraging you to take is at Paint a Miracle in Rochester. It's an art studio for those with special needs that's really going for it, creating something really special. But the art is also giving back to the artists. This piece of art I did a couple of days ago. It is a landscape I did with acrylic paint. Ryan Gray is a lot of things, enthusiastic, passionate, creative, which all seems like the makings of an artist. We have a mountain range, as you can see. We took some uh, grit paint and made nice rocks, and we have uh, some trees. Except the artist part came later. I love coming here because this place gives me a chance to do something I like to do. Here is Paint a Miracle, a modest art studio barely noticeable on the ground floor of an industrial building in Rochester. But what's happening inside, everyone should take notice of. Paint a Miracle is an art studio and safe place for people with different abilities, like Ryan or his friend Carly Guy. It looks like a Christmas tree. Carly has also found her passion and her mom, Mo, says it's helped her find herself. What really has happened over the years is she's learned project management, she's learned to slow down, and she's learned to do things in steps. This is the only place she can come to where she owns everything. Every decision is hers. Everything she creates is hers. Shelly Props and Lennon runs the nonprofit and says while art is their project, a supportive community shares the canvas. It gives so many people that otherwise don't have a place to go, a place to be, a community to be a part of. Um, a it gives them a sense of family. This isn't just for fun either. These artists are earning commission. Every year, Paint a Miracle hosts an exhibit displaying thousands of pieces of art. And now a year-round exhibit at the Busy Buzz Studio in Rochester. 40% of the sale goes back to the studio to pay for more supplies and cover the cost of classes. Our goal is to remove any barrier that might keep someone from taking a fine arts class, be it a phys physical barrier, cognitive barrier, or um, a financial barrier. The other 60% goes back to the artists, like Carly, who sees this check as more opportunity. Camping, say something for bowling, and say something for bus coming for, for work. So what's happening here at Paint a Miracle really is amazing, giving opportunities to people that would sometimes be looked over. But how this place got started is also an amazing story. When I was 15, my dad was hit by a drunk driver and he suffered a catastrophic brain injury. That crash put Dale in a coma for months. When he came to, he lost his eyesight. His wife spent years trying to find hobbies until an aide brought him to an art studio. It changed his life. I mean, it gave him a reason to get up in the morning. And so one day he looked at my mom and he said, Annie, we need to start an art studio for people like me. I have three younger brothers and my mom and, and the four of us siblings and my mom, we looked at each other and we thought, you know what, dad would have made this happen before his accident, so we're gonna make this happen. So 21 years ago, the first miracle was painted. And 21 years later, something miraculous happens every day. It's really important to give them the dignity that they deserve. You might think, oh yeah, that's pretty good for someone with this or that disability, but honestly, it'll knock your socks off. These people in Painted Miracle give me the inner zen that I need to have a good day to do something important. He's got the inner zen he needs. <laughs> if you have a story that embodies our Go For It spirit, drop us an email at goforit at wdiv.com or just visit clickondetroit.com. Ryan and the folks over at Paint a Miracle gave us one of these to put up in the newsroom. Oh, I love Isn't it. Isn't it amazing?